Hey everyone, it's Jordan from Fish Keeping Made Easy and today we are going to do a little review of this app called Picture Fish. Just a quick disclaimer, this video isn't sponsored at all. I came across this app through Facebook advertisement. I thought the app seemed pretty interesting and I wanted to do a review on it. So the app's function is pretty basic, it's basically you just take a picture of a fish and it will tell you what fish it is. Now, for fish keepers, this could be an invaluable tool as there's so many times you come across fish, either a picture on the internet or something you come across in real life and you really don't know what it is. And this app should hopefully solve this problem. So let's see how the app goes. So I thought I would start with a clownfish because that's the logo they have on the front. So at this point I was quite impressed as the app gave us the correct fish that we'd taken a picture of. It also came with additional information and photos and also frequently asked questions so I was quite impressed with all the information it was giving you. Next, I tried a picture of my gobi and, well, this didn't go as well as the last one. I think the gobi being on top of the coral kind of confused it a little bit. Now, I would give them a pass on this, but realistically, when you're taking pictures of fish, especially marine fish, they are going to be in amongst this kind of stuff. The other issue is that if it misidentifies a fish, it literally just saves it as that. So I tried again with the gobi, but I just got the exact same result. Next, I tried to get a photo of my Amazon puffer. Now, they are quite difficult to take a photo of anyway, but again, we didn't really get any matches at all. It did say puffer fish at the front there, and that was probably the best it could do. So basically what I tried to do now was just add photos of fish that I'd already taken, but what you'll see in the footage is it just kept giving me the wrong answer over and over and over again, and I was actually getting really disappointed with this app. It did get the better fish correct the next photo I'm about to upload, but it kind of seems like it can only really get basic, easy fish right. And I would say that's the fundamental problem with this app, as although I assume their target audience would be new fish keepers, I think it would be more advanced and experienced fish keepers that would actually use the app more often. Don't get me wrong, I think the app is a fantastic idea, but when it can't execute its primary functions, it's pretty disappointing. I actually had high expectations for this app, but now when I actually went into the app store, all the ratings are like one or two stars and say the exact same thing. So would I get this app? Well, I would get the free version, but I wouldn't pay for it at all. I think it's got a lot of potential, and if the developers keep developing it properly, it could be a fantastic app. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks very much for watching. Subscribe for more, and see you in the next one.